The PAM50 assay is designed around a biology of breast cancer rather than actually designed specifically around prognosis or patient outcome. And what that means though is when you design a test, and there are several on the market, um, actually most of the ones that are on the market are molecular tests are, are designed for prognosis around patient outcome. But the, the, the nature of weighting all those genes, selecting weighting the genes against patient outcome means that your test is, is in fact very specific for the patient set from which it was derived, though the treatment that those patients received. And when you try and extrapolate it outside of that initial setting, you'll find that the test performance will drop off. What's different about PAM50 is it's, it's a biological test. It's identifying the intrinsic subtypes of breast cancer. And that's a biology that holds whether you're old or young, node positive, node negative, whether you're treated with hormone therapy, chemotherapy or not, the biology is still the underlying biology of the breast cancer, which is, which is what it's measuring. And for that reason, it's likely to be relevant, to be telling us relevant information about a breast cancer in many different treatment settings, not just uh, the ones that were originally used on clinical trials that are 20 years old, for example, which are, are often what we're developing these tests on because we have 20 years of follow-up data that, that we can see. So that, that's one of the fundamental differences about it. It, it measures 50 genes. Uh, it's been moved to this nanostream platform, which is a very elegant, efficient uh, way of measuring RNA and paraffin embedded tissues. Um, and what's coming out now is, is a set of data on, on a series of clinical trials, um, in some cases comparing PAM50 with other tests, in, in other cases uh, extending indications or, or applying PAM50 onto other types of specimens. And so there have been some recent presentations also uh, in Europe and, and at ASCO about that.